Iraq for the last 40 years almost is being going from one war to another, from one sanction to another. Oil was never good for this country. Iraq is not often remembered as a British colony, but it was Britain that was responsible for drawing its borders after the First World War. To an extent, we created modern Iraq and then ruled it until 1932. And in 1927, it was the British who discovered oil right here in Kirkuk and built these offices. But after an hour of looking at them, I'm still none the wiser as to whether we'll be allowed into the oil field. Thank you. I'd like to announce my resignation from television documentaries as from now. <laughs> I'm going to work for the Northern Oil Company. There's a gap for me in the Department of Confusion. I have a very, very small desk which is upside down. And three men bring me cups of tea every 17 minutes. I bet when the British had this, there'd be people scurrying around and they'd be saying a lot of shouting. Hey, boy, boy, get my car. Then suddenly, there's a flurry of activity. He just gave me good news, like, we are free of movement. Fantastic. Finally. Fantastic. And finally, our cars and six more full of company officials make our way inside the oil fields of Baba Gurga. This is where oil was first discovered in Iraq. And the main reason the British knew it was here was thanks to this small area of naturally burning gas. It's known as the Eternal Flame. Almost 4,000 years, that's incredible, isn't it? This is quite a humble, modest site, not a, a lot to look at, and yet it's enormously significant because the fire here had been burning for 4,000 years. And this is what indicated that oil was round here. And you think of all the implications of that, the British taking over the Iraq oil industry, the war in Iraq, 2003, and over 90% of Iraq's economy is based on oil. This is where it started. Our friends from North Oil don't seem to be particularly chatty, so I decide to talk to Amar about the impact oil has had on Iraq. Do you think it's been a, a good thing for the country? Well, unfortunately, the oil was never good for this country. It was always the source of problem. It was always the source of war. 